Runs for Big Papi, runs for Stoinis. What about that catch from Bishnoi? And finally, a Pundia in this IPL not getting booed. You're watching the morning after IPL. The Shugman Gill license to three, 007. Okay! <laughs> Uh, Gujarat Titans, since they've come into the competition, I feel like they've been very steady. It's a team of sensible haircuts. But this year, struggling a little bit, a couple of losses, and now I've forgotten everything they've ever done good for me, you know? Everything out the window. All the success they've had, and now it's like a couple of losses are like, no, nah, no good. Boring. And, and, and LSG coming in at the same time as Gujarat Titans, mm. coming up the other way, he goes, mm-hmm. don't you feel, I feel like it's sensible haircuts. It's Justin Langer. It's Western Australian workman-like spirit. Mm. K.O. Rahul can't yeah. score a run yeah. uh, at any kind of pace, but he's captaining them to wins. Mm. Y- y- you know, they, they drag you down into the mud and beat you with experience, batting mm. first in that sticky wicket there. Mm-hmm. They win the Sunday night primetime fixture. The morning after up here is brought to you by Big Basket. Now, when do you want it? Do you want it within 10 minutes? Because they take that kind of stuff seriously. They take it seriously. Much in the same way that Justin Langer takes coaching seriously. Yeah. 10 minutes. 10 minutes or less. Get stuff to your door. Whatever you want. People have suggested in the comments things you can get. I'm not entirely sure that's... No. Probably can't repeat that, but... Yeah. Yeah. You can just read the comments and just see what people are suggesting. Yeah, indeed. Or well, one person. <coughs> uh, should we have a look at the scores for the game yeah. last night, Pezza? Uh, LSG win the game by 33 runs or some shit. Uh, they Not a classic. LSG batted first. No, it's a classic 5-1-63, 130 all out. It's yeah. a classic. It's a Taylor's oldest time, we're that one. familiar with that in Australia with the BBL. <laughs> <laughs> hey, runs for Marcus Stoinis, 58 yeah. of 43. Kale Rahul again. Another very slow 30 for him, but nice while, while it lasts. winning 30. A winning, a, a, 30. a winning 30, it's winning, a winning 30. 30. Goodrat Titans uh, started off nicely, but then fell well short, losing yeah. a whole bunch of wickets in mm. not many runs in a short amount of time. So that's what happened to, to the game. It was an absolute classic of 160 plays, 130. Yeah, it was an absolute Sunday night <laughs> classic. Uh, yeah, 160, 130, spin to win. Uh, Goodrat struggled post power play where they started well. I, I want to kick off first with uh, Papi and Nikki Puran. Uh, mm. So Papi... Um, W- wouldn't say he's won the game off his bat for a long time. Yeah, uh, in in most formats, just uh, lost his Aussie contract. Might be overblown a bit. He can he can uh, get upgraded with a couple of white ball games. Yeah, um, and I think he will be on the plane to the World Cup. But um, mm-hmm. yeah, he combined with uh, KL Rahul to to steadily build a score. That was after Boys Yadav got good right underway. Yeah, uh, with two in the power play, just that bull roaring in. Mm. He gets uh De Kock and Padikal, and um, he's looking fit. He's looking fit, uh, he's, he's looking fit boys. boys um, yeah. yeah, and that was yeah. verbally scored by Doss on commentary inviting us not to think of an apple uh, which is good and um so yeah pa- damn it now I'm thinking about an apple yeah, that's right <laughs> Papi um Papi joins KL Rahul they steadily build 73 off 62 or some shit uh, so yeah. you know put, putting some together yeah. they're in luck now um he had a bit of luck he was dropped by Rashid Khan who came in studs up with his shoelaces undone <laughs> uh, so, um and uh when, when, when KL got out for his uh, runnable 30 uh Nicky P came in and gave the innings a turbo charge it needed it was 49 from the final yeah. 5 overs 3 sixes. Yeah. Uh, no one looks uh, as cool as him hitting 6s uh and LSG you know so just, just work their way, just a bit, of, a bit of hard yakker out in the farm yeah. to 160 odd. Yeah. I think like uh, for, for Stoinis is in his 50 out of 43, two sixes, uh, four fours, hitting 134. Mm. In the context of the game, great going. Mm. High score of the match comfortably. But um, it's, hard, it's hard to figure out like uh, Stoinis recently because like he's such an important member of the Australian white ball setup for contributions on the field, sure, but it's also a vibe based oh, selection. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Right. He's, a, he's a package. It, it, it's, it's a package. It's a package. It's yeah. a package. Mm. And, uh, but I feel like I just want to see a bit more of this stuff, you know? Like, mm. uh, doesn't it doesn't like, have to be player of the cricket match? Runs. Cricket runs, like performances from, from mm. cricket um, performances. Performances, performances from, from cricket, cricket performances. No, 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 it took yeah. right out of my mouth. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm, yeah. Still, I'm thinking about an apple still. That's, <laughs> that's, my, that's my problem. <laughs> well, don't think about it. <laughs> Too late. A little mind trick. No, but I think, I think it, was, it was an important innings because I feel like it's, it's been a minute yeah. for Stoin. He's one of those guys when he hits the ball for six. There's only a few of them in the game where like it's, there's just a bit more force to it. Mm. Are you saying that they stay hit? I'm look, and I've, I've been um, musing and philosophizing on this recently. Yeah. The, the, the phrase, you know, when he hits it, it stays yeah, hit, it stays you know, as opposed to those th- those balls that you hit, yeah. and uh, yeah. at somewhere during the trajectory of it being hit, it's no longer it's hit. It's no longer hit anymore. That's what happened to KL Rahul uh, calling the boundary. <laughs> it, was no, it was no longer hit. But when Stoinis hits it, yeah. it stays it stays hit. That, yeah. that hit doesn't go away. <clears throat> anyway, he got some runs. Um, <laughs> 
Let's get to want now, get now. Yeah, okay. Because okay? the bowling innings really where it all happened for LSG. And I'm going to focus on Yash Takua, who has a day out. Mm. He goes, oh, this thanks to want now, get now, big basket now, backing TGC. Charlie, want to do your thing? <laughs> Do you want to do your little thing there, Charlie? Um, <laughs> Charlie's AI, by the way. Yeah. Um, is Charlie real? Yeah, is he actually indeed. Charlie Theron? Is Paul dead? Beatles stuff there. Yeah, um, nice. Right, so uh, Yash Takua, um, to be honest, um, was Yash Takua the what now, get now? You know, Is that what we wanted? No, we wanted my Aunt Yadav to bowl a toe-curdling, yeah. curling spell of fire and brimstone, yeah. but he got a side strain. Or Shadow okay. Takua to play the game. The Lord. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, <laughs> that, that's right. So is he Judas? Uh, yes, you could. Um, but sometimes you need a plan B when you can't have Mayank. Uh, so loves? Yadav. Um, so apparently yeah. Kale Rahul comes up to Yash Takua when Mayank goes down mm-hmm. and says, I need you to be the man today. And Yash says, my pronouns are they, them, but I take your point. <laughs> that didn't happen. That didn't happen. Um, but he... he uh, he takes five for 30. It's the first five from the IPL yeah, this year. Yeah. Um, and he starts by castling Shubman Gill. Now, yeah. the, the context for this dismissal, apparently KL, who's captaining excellently, yeah. uh, had a, so this is according to um, Yash, KL had advised, had, had advised that delivery, that that's what you've got to bowl to Shubman Gill. Now, I, I genuinely didn't know that Shubman Gill had <laughs> troubles with straight cross-seam <laughs> leg stump half volleys. But everybody has their Achilles heel. Everyone's got a weakness. Everyone's got their Achilles yeah. heel. And you can buy Achilles strapping at Big Basket now. Yeah, and it'll get to you within 10 minutes. Within 10 minutes, yeah. Shubman. Yeah, I mean, that, that that was quite a ball, wasn't it? Wasn't cross, it? Cross seam, full, and he, and he just yeah. backs away. And yeah. he just, he's got a bit of a blind spot there for the mm. half volleys on. You can bowl anywhere else and he'll punish you. But there, yeah. it's like, oof. That's right, mate. When, anyone who can get that cross seam yeah. straight half volley going. It's, it's a unique uh, skill, isn't it, that, yeah. to, to find that length and that line. But anyway, we want now get now. Interesting backstory to Yash. We always like a backstory. Oh, uh, no IPL stuff. Interesting yeah. backstory. So it's from yeah. v- v- Vidaba on the um, on the domestic circuit. I hope I've pronounced that correctly. Very much the understudy of Boys Yadav. Okay. In his team. Okay. So, um, uh, not not many backstories um, kind of uh, come back to the same place, um, but but it does with Yash. So what I'm trying to say is, um, wh- while at Vidaba, the captain and coach Praveen uh, Hinganaka. Mm-hmm. Um, he has this academy and Yash wanted when he signed up to this academy Yash wants to keep like Dhoni he wants to be a keeper like I was M- wondering how CSK like, were involved in this game I'm, yeah. I'm saying it's come back to the same place he wants to keep like Dhoni now Hinganaka watches Yash bowl um, casually in the nets and says never wear the wicket keeping gloves again oh. <laughs> <laughs> he now, must have gloved him pretty poorly that day <laughs> It's just, it was after he watched him bowl. Right. Said, Mate, you, you, you can bowl. Yash is disgruntled and says, I, but, I, but I want to be like Dhoni. And this is where the coach, and he's, he's an experienced, um, well-regarded coach in Indian cricket. This is where he shows his experience. Okay. You can cue this up here, Charlie, as well. This is Praveen with um, MS Dhoni as well. Yep. Um, according to Yash, uh, Higanaka said there are more ways beyond wicket-keeping to emulate Dhoni. And he's talking about mindset, approach to the game, etc. Uh-huh. Yeah. Now, get this. What were Yash's figures in the game? Do you remember? Yeah, five for 30. Right. Five into 30 is? Six. Yep. How many five-wicket hauls has there been in the IPL in 2024? One. Six plus one? Seven. Tell her for a reason. <laughs> and you can buy children's you can buy children's maths books at Big Basket now. Well, Pez, I can go one more. Do you know what his economy rate was? 7.82. Tell her for a reason. <laughs> Uh, second thing, beautiful Krunal, beautiful Krunal Panya, three for eleven from four over. This is where the, this is a, oh, sorry, wrong uh, one. Joe Root's not playing. Um, <laughs> three for eleven from four overs. Um, the most economical four over spell for LSG ever. Not bad. Two seasons. Not bad. The most economical four over spell versus Gujarat Titans mm-hmm. ever. Okay. Um, interesting character, Krunal Panya. Now, many people. Uh, many people are mistaken when they think that Mark Waugh's nickname is Junior. Right. Right? Um, that's wrong. For a long time, Mark Waugh was known as Afghanistan. Yes. The Forgotten the War. Forgotten War. Now, um, Charlie, just because I wonder if they call Krunal uh, Jin Jin, uh, Mexico's Forgotten Panda. <laughs> I, I, you can take that down now. I, I suspect not, but it's something to think about. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you know it's weird when Charlie's laughing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can, can you put that panda back on the screen, yeah, please? No, Jin Jin. Yeah. Look at the fucking head on Is that, that thing. Taxidermy? That taxidermy. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought 
was going to say, I was, I was That's reading, fucking I was, scary. I was reading about Jin Jin in National Geographic <laughs> 2023. Uh, yeah. Back in March there. Yeah. And I thought, you know what? That, that could be a nickname for Krunel. That, that's because I actually the had forgotten, forgotten about that panda. Yeah. I'd, forgo- I'd forgotten about they then. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. So, um, uh, anyway, yeah. Uh, it was a great uh, performance from Krunel, but uh, I wonder in this game, like, because they, they started off so well, GT in their chase. They were yeah. 54 without loss yeah. at the end of the sixth over. So nearly going at 10s, uh, chasing 160. And then they, what did they lose? They lost what, five for 25, yeah. like eight, eight for 40 or something it, it like was, that. It was spin to win. It was Bishnoi, yeah. Krunel, Pandya, and then Yash comes in but later. The, like, the, the deck didn't seem like that troubling. What's the thing, like, the the... the the common um, accepted narrative playing there in luck now is, you know, you bat first, get what you can, and yeah. then, and, and the deck is too paced and difficult. But yep. Shub McGill came off the field, uh, to his credit, yeah. and he just said deck was good, yeah. which which means credit to uh, LSG's bowlers, yeah. to be honest. Yeah, I suppose so, yeah. I mean, you, you look at, like, uh, the mode of dismissal, and it was a lot of loose batting. Yeah. Or, or just poor execution, I suppose, yeah. is what you would say if you were in the game. I'm not, myself. Mm, yeah, just shit shots. Just shit shots, Weak yeah. shots, shit I, shots. It, it didn't feel like they wanted it enough, oh. you know? It, it, I think it was a Desire. mindset issue. Yeah, it was. Okay. It was. Yeah, yeah. They, uh, it was they, yeah. No. yeah. No, got it. Got yeah. it. Um, Bishnoi combines with uh, Krunal Panja. We sorry with Jin Jin. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the forgotten. <laughs> the forgotten panda. Um, <laughs> to um, but he and he takes an absolute scream to get rid of Kane Williamson, who I think could have right. been very, very um, uh, important in this run chase. Uh, just given they're chasing 160. What's up? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> Uh, he takes his catch. He takes his catch. A lot of people yeah. are calling out that it looks very much like a goalkeeper's yeah. catch. Um, so, yeah. so this was actually, thank you. I, I know I haven't got the um, the credit there to the person who tweeted that. I'll just tell you. So credit to the account called Satan uh, with a blue tick <laughs> who's, who's ha- on Twitter whose handle is scent of a woman 10. <laughs> I thought I would give the correct credit. Just say it out loud. Thanks. Thanks, Satan. <laughs> Sent of a woman 10 for that. <laughs> that's got um that's got nothing on this so obviously I know it was a good catch from from Bishnoi but yeah. um it didn't get ah, the there it is. There it is. is. Stretch meter. There's a stretch meter. <clears throat> okay. Um uh. Yeah, so GT struggling. Can we can we have can we have a look at um that panther again? We just you, Jin Jin. Uh, um, no, seriously, thank you, thank you, no, Satan. Crudel um, just eating some bamboo. Uh, so just just fine. I, just, I want to take a look at. I mean, LSG uh, a third now on the table. Yeah, right. Yep. Um, I just want to assess uh, Kale Rahul and LSG mm-hmm. uh, because it's a it's a flying under the radar scenario. Yep. Um, LSG moved to third. Yep. Uh, they have won. 16 of the last of their last 17 games when they've defended under um, Kale Rahul's captaincy. So right. Kale Rahul's captaining and they're batting first, mm-hmm. they win 16 from 17. Yeah. Uh, something Amazing. like that. Yeah. Um, you know, so Kale Rahul's captaining well, LSG's doing well. Um, mm. Here's a stat for you, though, with in relation to Kale Rahul's mm. batting. Uh, of the 57 players who have faced at least 150 balls across the last two IPL editions, and I just counted that by hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Kyle Rahul is the only one with a <laughs> sub one twenty strike rate. Yeah, so but he's already in the team. So there, there, there are so many top order guys yeah. who could open, who could play in the top order for the India's T Twenty side. It is a real issue when they have all these guys scoring bulk runs at the top of the order, but especially with the impact player mm. um, rule now, where like you can just go and go and go, everything yeah. must go, Close, yeah. closing down rug sale, everything's got to go. Gotta go. Yeah, uh, now and so like the the idea that you need one guy to have a massive innings and you bat around that is I mean that's that's old way that's an old mm. way of thinking now mm. now it's like how many guys can you get hitting thirty of ten balls if you get eight guys doing that you're gonna have a pretty good score. Well, on that note, then um, with LSG and KL Rahul assessed uh, hashtag AskTGC. Mm-hmm. This is and I think it is somewhat connected. Uh, Amon Perex one seven four seven. Writes in and says, hashtag AskTGC, uh, are we allowed to posit that Butler played better than Coley or is that off the table vis-a-vis view counts and 150 million Instagram followers? Now, a lot of people yeah. may have thought that we didn't uh, cover the RCB game on account of yeah. their loss. Incorrect. Just had a break over the weekend. Yeah. Uh, that's all That's all that happened. Uh, and I think that's just to your point, you know, uh, <clears throat> like like um, if, if somebody bats for – 67 72 balls mm. and only finishes with a 113 runs your team may be in a more difficult 
um, pace yeah. when it comes to winning. It's wild, isn't it? Because when you see the it's numbers the next to each other, it's like, oh, fuck, he's batted well. And yeah. like, and that is true. But in the overall context of the team score, it's like, well, we could have actually accelerated further had the same. The, well, yeah. it just seems to be. I mean, the old, like for a long time, that idea of the anchor batter mm. um, permitting everyone else to go harder and faster yeah. was uh, – was de rigueur. Like, that's what people did. But as you say, because of the inc- impact sub, everybody can bat like those guys now. Yeah. Every, everybody should just be coming in and going uh, at deluxe pace. Uh, so I wonder, with Coley, for example, who will play, like, he will be in the Indian team, and yeah. talk about a package, oh. uh, and he should be yeah. in the Indian team. Like, I I wonder whether... These these continued high scores of Virat Kohli are actually doing him damage because <laughs> because he keeps scoring runs, they keep losing. Yeah. Uh, th- of course, the alternative suggestion is that uh, guys need to step up. Yeah. And they, and they definitely do. But yeah. like the more he scores runs at that pace, and the more they lose, the more it shines a light on the. Um, yeah. I guess the anachronism of that way of playing the yeah, game. Yeah, that's right. I mean, like if, if there's 60 balls to be faced in innings, it's actually more likely that four guys facing 60 balls are going to score more runs than one guy facing 60. Like that, that seems to be how it is. Mm. So, I mean, I don't know, but he's going to play. And like, he's just, and also he's just I, showing a ceiling, you know, and yeah. people are moving beyond it. Yeah. And you're like, you're not used to like uh, – a, a Coley hundred not being enough. Yeah, <laughs> and know? like, and and if I was Coley, I'd be like, shut the fuck up. I've got the orange cap, or if he's got it at the moment, or whatever. But like, I'm scoring all these runs. I'm the best I'm player sure in my be generation. Judged. Like, yeah. so shut the fuck up. Yeah. But at the same time, it's like, yeah, but uh. yeah, so yeah, can I, both I, things I, be true? Honestly, though, like if if Coley had failed in four games and just done so quickly, like just just got out, yeah. he'd be like, uh, he'll, he'll come good yeah. for the World Cup. Yeah. Like, yeah. Coley's yeah. scoring like fucking eighties and hundreds. Yeah. Yeah. And they're losing. It's like, hmm, yeah. okay. striking them at sort of 140. Yeah. Like, ah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I, I still like watching it. I yeah. still like watching it. So, I don't know. I mean, Parekh, I, I, I think we've answered your question there. It's not, it's not a view count thing. We just wanted a break. <laughs> How do we get Butler onto the thumbnail of this video? I guess we'll find out. Uh, that's what's happened in this game, LSG GT. It feels like a big game, but it feels like a game they've already forgotten, um, which uh, I feel... Yeah. I can't remember who Bishnoi plays for. <laughs> nah, that's not true. <laughs> we'll be back for the morning after IPL tomorrow. Click subscribe if you haven't already as we march towards 300,000 subscribers, at which point in time we'll, we'll uh, reveal Charlie to be indeed Charlie's Theron. Uh, see you guys on the internet tomorrow. <coughs> Cheers.